and welcome back, dear viewers, to next year's shitty fucking Dark Souls 3 playthrough. I killed a fucking giant! It was really boring. It took a long ass fucking time. But, we're here, we're back, and we've killed him. And he's dropped an item for us. How generous of him. What do you have for us, friend? A large shard, and a poo. Well, at least you tried. I'll give you effort, A for effort, for sure. Good, great. So, we came out that way. So we haven't seen what's on this side of the um, of the poop river just yet. I wonder what there could be over here. What what could we see? What could we find? What glorious wonders could possibly be on this side of the poop river? Some fucking gross dudes and a knight. Great. Well, let's shoot the gross dudes to get their attention. <laughs> we call that a twofer. That's what we call that one. That's a fucking twofer one right there, buddy, Buster. Buster Brown, Bucko Jim, Jimbo Bob, shit this fucking night. <laughs> the fucking headshot animation is so good in this game, honestly. Fucking Call of Duty, eat your eat your heart out, eat your ass out. Dark Souls is the best FPS in the game. Oh shit. Oh shit, that's quite bad. Oh shit, that's quite bad. <sighs> okay, I'm out of Estus. This is a total disaster. Um, I can Ember up. Okay, let's just. Let's just, let's just, let's just, let's just, let's just, let's just, let's just deal with this real quick. There we go. Problem solved. All topped up. All tippity topped up. All healed up. All ready to go. Fuck. I did a lot of damage. I don't think I want to fight this guy right now. I think it's time to leave. You know, we've seen the run past strat. This is the run away strat. Okay. Oh god, I thought that phantom was a uh, fucking enemy for a second there. I was terrified. Beyond terrified. Okay, good, great. That's dead. Perfect. I'm probably gonna end up being chased, but what the fuck ever, who cares? There's another door! Another shortcut! Woo! Everyone loves shortcuts. Bam 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 bam. That's like supposed to be the um the everybody loves fucking shortcuts. But it was actually like a really shitty version of Seinfeld, I guess. What the fuck even am I talking about? Who can say? But I can say that there's a gross boy down here. And you know what we do to gross boys? We fucking throw fire at him. Or I guess we miss with fire at them. Can you just stand still, please? Is this gonna work? Can I? No. Be careful not to fall off here. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. All right, whatever. It's fine. He's on fire, and now he's dead. Problem solved. Honestly, I don't know why you guys are stressing out about this shit. Items. A ring. Good. My fave. What is this? Huh. You. It's a fatty. Hey, if we can get out through here. Okay, so we are back here where the crystal lizard was. Great. I feel like there was probably a shortcut that we could have unlocked uh, if I didn't fall down there like an idiot. Um, but I guess that's just the world we live in. Great. Good. My favorite. So basically, instead of unlocking a shortcut and cutting down on our future travel time, I fucking just dropped down. Yeah, see, look at that door. I bet that's the fucking door that you get to open up if you're not a complete fucking incompetent idiot. But unfortunately, that's just what channel you're on right here. You're on the next channel where we can't play the fucking video game because we suck at it. Um, we, this is obviously the royal we. I'm referring to myself when I say we. I mean, if that wasn't obvious by now, um, I mean, it might not be. But the point is, whenever I say we, I don't actually, I'm not including you, the viewer, you know. I don't want to include the viewer in any way in my uh, in my in my video experience. This is entirely about me. This this art I'm creating, this fucking artistic masterpiece of this let's play playthrough, is purely masturbatory. Purely masturbatory. I don't want to involve any other any other gamers, any other viewers, any other individuals in any way. So great, the giant's dead now, so he won't be punching me. So you know, if we weren't uh, such brave boys. We could have, uh, we could have fucking killed the giant first, and then gone through and get the items. But fortunately, I've got balls of steel, and it's no problem at all to just fucking get on with it and kill the boy. And so that's what we did, and that's what happened. Great, good. Hmm. This is an advanced run past strat here. This is called take the high ground, drop down, and then fucking just run past all the enemies. That's the strat. That's the entire strat. It's just run past all the enemies. That's, in fact, most of my strats. You can sort of just boil them down to, to that level. Um, I think that's probably okay. It's a pretty, you know, reasonable strategy to go with. Run past all the enemies. 
Oh my fucking god, no. Well, I've been NPC invaded. Uh, fortunately, with a name like Kirk, that's gotta be a, uh, a reference to uh, fucking, yeah, Kirk of Thorns. Look at that, he's wearing the Thorns armor. You can tell. Um, so he'll be an NPC invader. So hopefully, maybe, it's gonna be okay. I mean, last time we got NPC invaded, I fucking died and lost like a million souls, I think. Maybe I'm misremembering, but whatever. It's fine. <sighs> Upside, uh, he cancels a player, so he's all slowed up by this fucking goopy swamp. So we can maybe fucking take an advantage there, bring that into our advantage. Maybe we can bring it into our advantage? Maybe we can... No? Okay. Oh shit, I'm almost out of arrows. I bought like fucking 20,000 of them at the start of the game and I'm almost run out. Jesus. Alright, whatever. Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough, motherfucker. Take me on. Take on me. Yeah. You think of that, motherfucker? Oh god. His armor is too spiky. Just rolling near me does damage. That's very spooky. Out of... Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, good. He didn't repost. He didn't stab me in the stomach. Come on. Just like one more hit. God. This fucking man rolling near me is killing me. But luckily, my sword going through him is killing him faster. Nice. Got his items. Let's fucking open him up. What do we see? 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 Where is it? Barbed sword. There it is. The sword of Longfinger Kirk, the infamous Knight of Thorns. The blade is li lined with thousands of deadly thorns. Great. There's no lore on there, but whatever the fuck. Who cares? What about the shield? The shield of thorns. Let's open that one up. The notorious Knight of Thorns. Its vicious design makes it an effective weapon, and the thorns can inflict heavy bleeding when it's unfortunate enough to be struck. Well, you didn't tell me about all the cool deep lore about how fucking Kirk of Thorns is from the Dark Souls 1. He's another returning friend, or a returning enemy, I guess. Fucking Kirk of Thorns. He would invade the player throughout the game, and like he was sort of referred to in items as the uh, the Dark Wraith Kirk. So, you know, Dark Wraiths were the uh, were the fucking invasion covenant. So you're like, oh shit, he's just a dark, he's just a fucking invasion boy. He's coming into my world to kill me and steal my humanity. But actually, if you kill them all the times, if you kill them all of the times that he would appear in your world, you would find out that he's actually not a Dark Wraith. Spoilers! Oh my fucking god, no, 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 no. He's actually not a Dark Wraith. But he's a fucking, um, I don't remember the covenant name. The fucking daughter of chaos, the fucking chaos assistants, the people, the people who fucking the spider lady. They, he was helping the spider lady because you killed this, you fucking killed the spider lady. But she had a sister, and the fucking her sister, the the fucking spider lady that you killed, she was trying to protect her sister. That was the reason why she was trying to kill you. But then you fucking killed her, so so the so the sister is gonna die. And the sister was a nice lady. She never did anything wrong. She 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 was just a, oh my fucking god. I'm trying to explain the lore, you piece of shit. Fucking asshole knight! Fuck! Ah! Ah! God fucking damn it. Look, there was actually no point to anything I was saying. It's all totally irrelevant. It's fucking, who cares about Dark Souls 1? This is Dark Souls 3! It's two numbers higher! It's gotta be two numbers better, right? Obviously. God fucking damn it. I'm so sick of this fucking swampy, swampy bullshit. I was complaining about the fucking swamp like 30 episodes ago. That was a different swamp, but the, the same principle applies. Swamps are fucking bullshit, and I'm sick of this. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna fucking cheat. Do I have a dagger here? Uh, does this count? Probably not. Ah, fuck. Is this gonna work? Shield splitter. Quick step. Aha! Uh -huh. So if we equip this as, this as a weapon, and then we two-hand it, and we do this. Yeah, that's what I'm fucking talking about. Let's see that little jump forward. That's what we're gonna use to get through the swamp. These are the pro strats from Nexi. You get ready for this shit. This is gonna blow your tiny mind out of your tiny balls. Get ready. Buster Brown. Fucking hell. Gotta go all the way around again. My souls are just down there. You're gonna take that drop. You're gonna survive that. Maybe not. Maybe not. A risk too great for me. Thanks very much. God, these fucking guys. This guy's just gonna stab himself, try and kill me. But he's not gonna succeed. He's just gonna commit Sudoku, Onaburu Sudoku, and uh, he's not gonna be part of this living plane any longer. And frankly, I'm all too happy about that. Honestly, if you're gonna fucking Kill yourself to try and kill me. That's above and beyond what is what you can be truly deemed accessible. Except accessible. God. God, fuck off. Alright, it's fine. We've got the strats. The fucking dagger. It's coming through. We can escape. 
We can leave. We can move at the speed of sound. Look at how fast I'm going through this gross ass swamp. I'm not, I don't have to deal with your shit, you fucking gross, gross gremlin boy. Fucking hell, please. Please. Good fucking Christ, just stop. Jesus Christ. And this fucking arrow boy is shooting at me as well. Just everyone is out to get me. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of it. It's bullshit. No, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Just head on through. Alright, this fucking knight. He's a real asshole. I can't fucking kill him. I'm gonna give up. That's the official call. I'm just gonna do the run past. And unlock the shortcut. And then we'll be done with this. Oh shit. Fuck. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were fucking made. God, this is a disaster. Oh god. There we go. We're out of here. We're out of here. Just gotta fucking run down these stairs. That's not the stairs. Just gotta run down these stairs. Grab the shortcut real quick. Come on, come on. There we go. The door's open. We're ready to just run past. There we go. Alright. And now the shortcut is right here. In fact, there's two doors. Now, isn't that interesting? Let's open them both up. See where they see where they arrive us at. See where we're going to end up. Oh, there's an elevator. Interesting. Where could that take us? Who can say? But I bet we know where this fucking door is going to take us. I bet we can have a couple of guesses where this one's going to take us. Could it be fucking back to the same bonfire again? <gasps> yes, it is! This is what I fucking mean. This whole level is based around this one area. Look at how fucking, like, inter intertwined it is and, like, perfectly designed and perfectly executed to fucking give us the perfect gaming experience. And, boy, G. Willikers, is it ever the best shit that was ever made? Yes, it is. Timmy? Timmy, my viewer Timmy, who's so impressed by this fucking Dark Souls shit, it's the good shit. Oh boy, do I ever love it. Great. It's a fucking asshole. See, this is this is the area, you know, where we, because the, the fucking main door is locked, so we had to come all the way up here and all the way around. And now we're up here. What can we do while we're up here? What a what a fantastic question. Let's have a quick look around and figure it out. See if we can see if we can ding dang deal it, figure it out. We can come out here onto the ledge and drop down, but that doesn't seem like a very useful thing to do. We can come around here. Ah, now this, ah, now isn't this interesting? There's a ladder. Where could this take us? What possibly could be up here in this sort of secretive, semi-hidden area? There's a guy. Well, we know what we do with guys. We fucking kill them. There we go, dealt with. There's a message, what does it say? Jumping required ahead? I don't think so. Bucko Brown? Deep ring. And a bell. A guy who dropped a deep ring. What does the ring say? Whatever could it possibly say? Where the fuck is it? There it is. Allows achievement of additional spells. In the cathedral, slumber in the cathedral, slumber things most terrible. And as such the deacons require a good a grand narrative to ensure that they do not falter in their duty, a philosophy to ward away the madness beckoned by the grotesqueries at hand. Well isn't that just interesting? Fucking please, controller, hello. Great. The cathedral slumber things most terrible. Could that be the fucking, like, the giant spider monster we found? Could that be the sort of thing that's slumbering most terribly in the fucking cathedral? Probably, but honestly, who gives a fuck? The lore is bullshit, everything sucks. This episode is ever long, it's too long, it's time for it to end, so I will see you next time, viewers. See you next time. Ah.